Stand by. Okay. And here we go in three, two, one. The butterfly, uh-uh, that's all. Let me see the tips and roll. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the intermission. And what a stunning development that poor Duckfoot shared with us. Frankly, it's truly sad. This business with the elephant, so truly sad. I know something that could cheer everyone up, Mr. Finhart. You do? Yes, something that could make even a sad clown happy. Really? Well, share it, man. Here's my advice. Just hand out a handful of these big nickel-sized Tootsie Rolls. They'll give you an energy lift. Put a pep in your step. A guarantee to put a big grin on anyone's face. Just remember that Tootsie Rolls is a candy that can't be beat. It's so chewy, so chocolatey, so delicious, it will tickle your taster. Goodness, I do believe you're right. Already, I feel more chipper myself. Why, sure, Mr. Finhart, everyone, I mean everyone, is happy to see Tootsie Rolls. Why, they're an all-American favorite from coast to coast, with little folks and big folks, too. You simply can't lose when you choose Tootsie Rolls. Here, have another big nickel-sized Tootsie Roll. And now, bring on the second act, Mr. Finhart. We're going back to Dick Tracy and the case of the Big Top Murders. Tracy? You say nobody has seen Mr. Duckfoot. No one's seen Duckfoot, Mr. Shill? <laughs> no, Mr. Tracy. He didn't show up for the evening performance either. Show just ended five minutes ago. I see. Well, hold on to him when and if he does come back. I, I will, Mr. Tracy. I'll, I'll let you know. I'll call. It's very important, you know. I realize that. Well, goodbye. Goodbye. Duckfoot the Clown's still missing, eh? Yes. Tracy, do you think that maybe he may have, well, you know, met with foul play? Now why do you say that, Tess? He knew that Zelda had been murdered. But how? How How did he know? By looking at those photographs that Tess took of the tragedy, old man. We told you that. You know, I've looked at those photographs from every possible angle, Vitamin. You've looked at them. Tess has looked at them. Have you been able to see anything that would indicate murder? No. But he said it was murder. Said it very definitely old man. You know, this is the most confusing case I've ever had. But I have a hunch. Just a hunch that a murder has been committed. Duckfoot confirmed that hunch. And then disappears. Here, it's 11 o'clock already and he hasn't returned. Why didn't you two hold him there until I got back? We told him that you'd want to know what he said. But he wouldn't stay, Dick. He said he had a score to settle. His very words, old man. It's a big help to me. About these pictures, Dick. Yes? Do you think it might help if they were larger? No, it might. We'd be able to see them more clearly. These these little candid-sized shots are way too small. Give them to me. I'll take them home and enlarge them. It won't take a half an hour. We'll come along, me dear girl, and help. You can come along, Vitamin, but Dick has to wait for Mr. Shill's call. That's right, I nearly forgot. I shall remain here too, then. Well, see you both later. Oh, yes. Tess, yes. See you you later. What's the matter, old sleuth? You don't seem your usual keen self tonight. Vitamin, this case has got me completely baffled. Now, now, baby, fake 
can't let you out of your cage. Go to sleep. That's a good baby. Come on now. There. Fight. Fight on. Hey, Cuck Where have you been? You missed two shows. So pissed. What if I come in and the rest tent fight? No. Come in. I have something to talk to you about. Have you seen Shell? Or Tracy? No, I, I don't want to see them. I want to stay away from the show for this afternoon tonight. I want to see you first, alone. About what? Have you, have you seen the photographs? What photographs? Taken last night by Tracy's friend, Tess Trueheart. She's got all down on film how Zelda was killed. So what? I saw how she was killed. Her elephant trampled her. No fight. He didn't trample her. He trampled her cape. The picture showed very plainly. Yeah? Well, what do you want me to do about it? You killed her, Fay. No! No! You killed her. You're as guilty as if you placed a gun to her forehead and pulled the trigger. You're crazy! Am I? You were jealous of her. Jealous because she outshone you. Because she was a bigger star than you were. I didn't kill her! The photographs will tell their story, Faye. The photographs. And I will say the one thing, and they'll convict you. You can't prove it. Anything you say, they won't believe you. You hated her too. You could have done it. No! No! I loved her. I loved her. She mocked you. Ignored you. You were the dirt under her feet, and she... Oh, she noticed the viewers. I loved her and you killed her! What are you gonna do? I'm gonna tell him. Wait, Duckfield, look. I got some money. I got it saved. You can have it! You killed her! Take the money! Keep your mouth fucking shut! <laughs> no, Fay. I'm gonna tell him! I'm gonna tell him about the kite! Duckfield, come back! Listen! He's gone. Only one thing to do. Only one way to stop him. Oh, baby. Go get him, baby. Go get him for me. Go. He'll stop him. Stop him forever. <laughs> what you doing, pretty kitty cat? No, no. What, what you doing? Whoa! 